But first up tonight, people in our area are still dealing with the effects of Hurricane Harvey that destroyed many businesses and homes. Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Drew Spire. Some struggled to find the money to renovate, while others had to leave everything behind. One man, though, was able to receive a second chance to create new memories in his home. However, the homeowner says contractors didn't do a good job. Action 10 News reporter Jeremiah Marshall is live in our studio with more. Jeremiah. Yeah, Drew, Richard Garcia says this has become a stressful situation for him with many repairs that have just gone wrong. Half of my house was knocked down, so I was happy to get a new house back. Richard Garcia was fortunate to receive a grant from the Texas General Land Office to rebuild his home. But that good news turned worse once JWTC Construction, a branch from the Valley who were hired with the project, took over. So sooner or later, this house is not going to be worth what they paid for it. Major issues include the house hovering over the foundation, roofing, and in the front, a noticeable septic tank with broken pipes. Uh, it's just terrible. They broke the, the vents were in the wrong places. They were in the closets instead of the restrooms where they're supposed to be. The plumbing was wrong. I just had nothing but a nightmare. Garcia called JWTC for answers, yet have not heard a response. He also reached out to the GLO. All the papers they gave me, they didn't give me much. And Garcia was reminded to follow the responsibility of homeowner section in his contract, stating how he can't interfere with the contractor's work. I don't know. I've just been real stressed out ever since I got the house. I stay, I can't sleep right. I got to drink pills just to go to sleep because the doctor thought I was going to have a stroke. I had so much problems with these people. Nobody wanted to help me. Everybody gave me the run arounds and they just kept sending me to different people, different people. And I, nothing ever got done. Exactly. And Garcia exactly. says he hopes all this will get resolved and gets the home that he was promised. Sometimes I wish I never got the house because my house was better than the one I got now. And Garcia is not allowed to sell or make upgrades to the home and is bound by a three year contract with the program. Now we did reach out to JWTC Construction. So far we have not heard back from them. In studio, Jeremiah Marshall, Action 10 News.